SciSpy.tv, merging science and spirituality, is proud to present Ancient High Technology with Brian Forrester. Enjoy. Thank you so much for joining us, Brian. A pleasure. Thank you. I have seen you on so many videos at different <laughs> sites. Mm -hmm. The most recent one I saw you at was at Lake Titicaca. Uh -huh. That was a really fascinating episode. And you were really talking about how, you know, historians have theorized that they drug these, you know, these big megalithic rocks on some kind of rafts and just really saying, no way. No. Tiwanaku was found by the Tiwanaku culture about 2,000 years ago in ruins, like a megalithic site that had been damaged by cataclysm, and they used the stone to rebuild structures the way they wanted. So it became their ceremonial place, whereas Pumapunku was buried in mud because this cataclysm had struck probably 12,000 years ago from Lake Titicaca and buried the site in mud, so it wasn't rediscovered until the early 1900s and that's where you find perfectly precise stone fitting next to each other where you can't fit a human hair in between. Is it the H-block site? Exactly, uh -huh. exactly. Mm -hmm. And it's you know, located 13,000 feet above sea level. There are no trees, so there are no trees for rollers. Um, so who built it and when and why and how is... I've been there 55 times so oh far. My. Goodness. I'm slowly cracking the code of the place. But it's like going and a, and a giant book is presented to you. It's like you're on page 14, you can reach page, page 15, then we close the book again. Because you're never going to understand this in even 55 times, but by, by the hundredth, you'll probably have cracked the code. <laughs>